Hi and welcome to a video presentation from EasyBatrix.com. In this video, I will show you some variations of the trick lighter below the bottle. Um, the challenge is to remove the lighter without the bottle falling over. And we got another movie at our website uh, explaining the original trick in detail. And in this video, I will show you some variations on how you can take the lighter without the bottle falling over. But first I will show you the original way of doing it and then I will show you three different variations. Okay, the original way is like this. You put your index fingers behind the lighter, you measure up 10 or 15 centimeters and you pull your fingers very fast towards yourself, like so. And that is how you can remove the lighter from underneath the bottle. And now I will show you some variations. The first variation that I will show you is based on a technique where you snap your fingers. When you snap your fingers, your fingers get a very good speed. That is why you produce that snapping sound. And you can use that speed to remove the lighter. So what you'll do is that you will place your fingers uh, behind the lighter, just a couple of centimeters or so, and then you will snap your fingers. Like that. And the bottle will be standing perfectly upright. Um, the speed from the snapping removed the lighter so fast that it just fell straight to the table. The second variation that I'll show you is also based on a technique where you snap your fingers. Instead, this time you only use one hand instead of two. And this is uh, by far the coolest way, I think, to remove the lighter. It looks like this. And as you can hear, it also produces a dramatic sound. What happens is that the lighter starts rotating and it hits the bottle um, after, you, after it's removed. Um, one thing is that when it does that, it can unstabilize the bottle. So if you want to be more safe, you can just place a finger here and that will make the lighter uh, move away from the bottle. So it will have a movement going like this, away from the bottle. But this is a very cool way, uh, I think, to remove the bottle, uh, remove the lighter from underneath the bottle. The last variation that I will show you is very simple. You just grab the lighter with your index finger and your thumb and you remove it. Now this looks easy, but it's not easy at all. Actually, this is the hardest way. I can only do it because I've practiced it a lot. Uh, if anyone else <laughs> tries this without having practiced at all, uh, chances are that the bottle will fall over. It's just to give you some safety that this is not a bad bit. There might be several ways that you can take the lighter, but it doesn't mean that anyone will figure them out. It seems obvious uh, now that they are presented to you and with instructions, but go out and perform it anyway. People won't be able to take the lighter without the bottle falling over. Uh, I'll just explain to you in a little more detail how to do it this way. You grab it uh, with your index and your thumb, and you push down, it helps to push down against the table a little bit, and then you push the lighter in a fast motion away from yourself, like so. Actually, I'm kind of glad that the bottle fell over there, because it shows that it's not easy at all. This is the hardest way to take it, even though it looks as if it's the easiest one. Uh, but I'll do it again, like so. So, as you can see, chances are that the bottle will fall over, but I still wanted to uh, present this variation to you, practice it and use it uh, if, if you like it. Um, and those were the three variations uh, of ladder below the bottle. Have fun with them and uh, go out and perform this beautiful trick. If you've seen this video on a video sharing site on the internet, you should consider to stop by our website. It's easybartricks.com. We have a huge collection of bar tricks and easy to do magic tricks. Everything is completely free and everything is presented in video with detailed instructions. Uh, please rate this video if you liked it and feel free to leave a comment. And remember that there are more videos at easybartricks.com.